This TikTok page is exploding right now with views. They started posting videos about 15 days ago, and their most popular video has gotten over 64 million views. That's crazy. And they have gained over 300,000 followers. You guys have been sending me DMs to make a video about this page, and here it is. Let me show you guys exactly how to make this type of video step by step. But first, like this video so more people get to see it. The first thing you need to do is visit Pinterest and find a character like this. What you just need to do next is click on your mouse and save the image to your computer. Now that we have the image, it's time for us to generate our images using AI. We are going to be using Whisk, but first, we need to generate our image prompt with ChatGPT. So copy the prompt that I've added for you guys in the video description below, and then come to ChatGPT, paste the prompt, and ChatGPT is going to give you a prompt just like this. All you just need to do now is to copy the first one. Go back to Whisk, click on Add Images here, then go to Subject under Upload Image, click on it, and then upload the image you downloaded from Pinterest. Then, you can immediately paste the first prompt you copied from ChatGPT here. Before you click on Generate, you need to change the aspect ratio. So click on this icon here, and then make sure you're selecting Portrait for YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels, and TikTok. Then, when you're done, just click on this arrow icon here to generate your image. What I have shown you is the exact step that I use in generating these images you're seeing right here. Okay, so now that we have the images, the next thing we need to do is convert these images into animation. And we are going to add animation using VEO3. To get the best results, I'm going to be using Clippy AI to access VEO3. You can get the link to Clippy in the video description below. To generate your video with VEO3 in Clippy AI, the first thing you need to do is click on two over here and select AI Playground. Immediately, it's going to bring you to the page where you are going to be able to convert your images into animation. When you are here, the first thing you need to do is click on Select Model, go through the models, and pick the one you want. Obviously, we are going to be using VEO3 because it's the best for this kind of video. I actually tried the other models like Sea Dance and Sora, but the output was not as good as VEO3. Click on it, and then you're going to see that it's selected here. The next thing we need to do now is to change the text to video to frame to video here. Immediately, you're going to see these two plus icons pop up here. Click on the first one and upload the first image you create. Also click on the second one and upload the second image you created. The next thing is to change the aspect ratio to 9 to 16 for TikTok, videos, Instagram, Reels, and YouTube Shorts. Now, for the resolution, it's best for us to leave it at 180p, and then for the time, we need to extend it to 8 seconds. Now, when we've done all the settings, before you click on Generate, you need to add a prompt. I've already created a prompt for you, and you can get the link to this prompt in the video description as well. So, copy the prompt, paste it here, then you can now click on Generate. Give Clippy some time to generate your animation. Now that we have the animation, the next thing we need to do is to click on the download icon here to download the clips to our PC. After that, we need to edit the video together using CapCut. You can use any of your preferred editing software. Click on Import and add your clips. What you just need to do now is drag the first scene into the timeline, followed by the second scene, and make sure you align them properly, just like this, and you're done. You can now click on Export. As What I just showed you here is the exact step this creator is using to make all these videos. You're welcome. 